Hey everybody, this is Grayson from Proceed to Checkpoint, and I'm here today playing some of the Halo 5 Guardians Arena Multiplayer Beta. Um, I played a little bit of this earlier, um, not very much, just one or two games, matches, and I'm very very bad at it, but I think that it would be of benefit to show it off on the channel, um, and to show people what it's like before they want to dive in and things like that. If they haven't gotten the Master Chief Collection after it's... Um, uh, less than preferable uh, launch period. Uh, I'm still not sure if it's, you know, uh, up to scratch as to what it, you know, uh, lent itself to be or made itself out to be. Uh, but anyway, we're going to press on with Halo 5 Guardians. This is the main menu. It's slick as shit. Um, Halo 5 Guardians Arena Multiplayer Beta is the only thing that's currently available to us. So that's all that we can select. We can select the Halo channel, but it's bullshit. Uh, there's the Spartan Hub, which, you know, shows you your Spartan, you know, you can rotate him around, not particularly well. Um, and then as you, I presume, as you rank up, you can change, like, the visors and all this other bullshit. The same way as you used to be able to uh, back in the day on the other uh, versions of the games. Uh, I'm going to go pink, and my secondary color will also be pink. Sweet. Um, my service tag. Eh. May as well make this BTC. Um, well that didn't save it. Ugh. Yeah, fuck it. Don't care. Anyway, let's jump in with the Arena Multiplayer Beta. Uh, Slayer is the only playlist that is available, so we're going to be selecting that, and we're going to jump right in, and we're going to see if a match can be made particularly quickly. Um, earlier on, as I said, I did play a match or two, and I did find a match relatively quickly um you know it's nowhere near as bad as evolve was i mean look at that that's a match right there um now as i said mentioned evolve there you know it some came to mind that you know some people might view this as slightly hypocritical uh due to the reasons you know we gave as to why we didn't cover the evolve beta like the big beta that they did back in the day or back when um when evolve beta the the, the alpha even was around uh so I would just like to kind of like say about that that after I I played Evolve, it um it was awful. It was an awful experience. You know, it didn't match make properly, and um, as a result, I didn't feel right covering that on the channel. However, having played this, you know, match was made very quickly. Uh, it looks very good, um, and uh, we're just gonna play a little bit here, and you know gonna have a hands-on first impression. The first thing that springs to mind is you can now sprint and you can also now dodge slightly. So it's got that kind of um, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare kind of jetpack thing going on um, which is also a Titanfall thing. Um, so presumably we're going to be calling this Spartanfall or something along those lines uh, fairly quickly. Uh, you can also aim down the sights, which I don't do very well, um, and I'm really, really bad at this, as I said at the start of this video. Um, but, but uh, you know, I seem to be doing okay right now. Maybe it was just a bad game. Maybe it was a bad matchup for me. Um, as always, you know, you can throw grenades and things like that. Now, one thing that hasn't been included in this, as best as I can tell, is the abilities that kind of came along with um, Halo Four or Halo Reach. Um, so, like. You don't have like the scout class or like the jetpack or anything like that going on. Um, now you do, you know, when you sprint, you do have kind of a Spartan barge attack. I think that's what they've called it, which is that, um, or even um, that. So um, it's pretty cool. Uh, it's not something that I would, you know, use too often really, or even consider using particularly often. Uh, but. Um, you know, it's it's a it's a nice little addition, you know. Just need to find my prey. I'm awful at aiming down the sights. That's a submachine gun, and I haven't really picked up any other guns, um, you know, over any of the matches that I've played, aside from the battle or the assault rifle that I used to use normally anyway, because I was a scrub that didn't like to aim using the assault rifle or the um the battle rifle. Um, so yeah, that's how I do. Awesome. 
However, I will show you the Magnum, which is pretty slick. Um, so yeah. So the sprinting animations are a bit weird. You know, it doesn't make sense to me. It, it, it doesn't feel unnatural to me. You know, that the Halo series has this now. Also has these ridiculous kill cams now as well. I guess it's just to make it really accessible to the Call of Duty crowd. Um, uh, and, you know, all that kind of jazz. You know, but... For people who have played all of the Halos, like, over the course of the years... Um, you know, it, it feels a little muddy. It feels like something that shouldn't... That feels unnatural, you know, for for the series. Like, over the course of this beta that I've played, Spartans haven't felt particularly um, sturdy. You know, they've been a bit squishy, like, to use um, an MMO term. Um, and I don't like it. You know, it's a, you're a Spartan, you're supposed to be this badass warrior that can't be killed by anything, or very few things, you know. Uh, and, you know, you're, you're going down in a couple of hits. I mean, if I just... That took, what, two seconds? Three tops for me to die there, uh, under gunfire. Um, which isn't something that has happened in previous, you know, Halos. Multiplayer, especially. Uh, like, I remember many many battles in Halo 3 and a couple in 4 I, although I didn't really dabble too much in Halo 4 multiplayer um, but definitely in 3 and actually in Reach um, playing the online multiplayer basically just running towards my opponent with my battle rifle or assault rifle um, both of us aiming directly at the other and firing constantly and then the the what actually decided the winner of the fight at the end of the day was whoever hit the B button, the the melee button first, you know? And those were kinds of those things that, you know, it was your skill that kind of, you know, knowing exactly when to push the button, you know, that decided who won it, you know, as opposed to, you know, being a squishy. Eh, I'm probably rambling a bit, and uh, I'm probably looking at this, at the previous games through rose-tinted glasses, but, you know, it was the shit. Oh, got another guy up here, eh? Why isn't my shield back? Why is that so annoying? But hey, I guess for those, um, anyway, as I was saying, you know, for those those old nostalgic moments, I guess I can, you know, whip open the um, the Master Chief Collection and just go back and play the old Halo 3 maps um, that haven't been optimized, maybe. Um, and uh, see what I can do to, uh, to, you know, get my fix. Ah, here! I punched him in the face! Jesus Christ. Back in the day, that would have been him done. Oh, son of a bitch. Also, the grenades don't appear to have a particularly large blast radius. You know, I, I feel like it's been nerfed. I guess what I'm saying at the end of the day is give me the old games. Give me the exact same game that I am used to, because I'm a crotchety old man. That should probably sum up this video, but I'm just going to finish out this match anyway. You can do a boost! Oh. It's pretty cool, and it is a really nice looking game as well. Ah, ah, he's got a sword! Um, it is a really, really nice looking game. You know, that's and full credit to 343 Studios for doing that. Good job, guys. You made a really slick looking game that I may or may not want to play. Nice work. You fucking dickhead. And that's how I died. 
Did they have kill cams in the older ones? I don't think they did. I think kill cams are a new addition as well. Again, in the tradition of Call of Duty and Battlefield and Medal of Honor and all that jazz. Yeah, I got a kill from someone that probably isn't playing. I don't like this um, sprinting animation though. Just make him fucking sprint. Although I suppose that I can't really complain about, you know, um, you know, the, the Spartans being squishy and not being badass, and then they do this to kind of make them look like they're badass warriors uh, by giving them like a sweet sprint animation, like they're running extremely fast because they're peak, you know, above human abilities and speed and things like that. Um, but it just seems like it's it's a counterintuitive move, I suppose, at the end of the day, uh, on 343's uh, part, you know, to do that. You know, slightly hypocritical maybe. But I didn't say that. That's off the record. Go on the boys! Yes, I killed him! Yeah! Huzzah! Blue team won. Good job, blue team. Good job. And it gives them that last little um, animation there as well. I'm not qualified in this place. Places. I've got eight matches left to qualify. Um, and I got that. So that's pretty cool. So someone's talking in my ear right now. I've muted myself, but I don't care. Anyway, thanks Tom for watching, guys. I'm going to leave it here for this for the moment. And uh, thanks Tom for watching, guys. You know, I really appreciate your time. Uh, and uh, you know, thanks for taking the time out to watch this video through to the end. And um, you know, if you like what you see, hit the like button. Maybe hit the subscribe button for any follow-up videos or any other videos for betas or alphas down the line that I might do. I'll probably do one for the Evolve beta in January 18th. I think that's when that's coming out uh, on Xbox One. Um, only if it's improved and if I feel as though you're going to be getting value out of it, uh, if it's worth doing. And um, yeah, I, I guess that kind of sums it up. And you know, if you have any comments about my gameplay, about how I did in this video, you know, feel free to leave a comment into the comment section below. If you have anything about any complaints about anything that I talked about in this video, and, and or any of the rambling that I did, again, feel free to leave a comment into the comments field below. I won't be offended in any way, shape, or form. And if I am, I will eviscerate you verbally. Um, but as I said, you know, appreciate your time. Hit the like, subscribe button. Thanks a ton for watching. Catch you next time. Much love. Bye-bye.